What's up guys? This is DiveD710 coming out to you for YouTube. Today we're busting down a little bit of a different video. We're busting a how to fill up a bong video. Some of y'all out there might not know how to fill up a bong to get it to the right perfect draw, get percolation to the maximum, and not get a splashy hit. So in this one I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show you guys how to fill up these two Medicali bongs. I'm going to dab off one and bust some flour off the other. <coughs> First comes first, I'm going to fill up Mini Medicali over here. This thing's my daily driver for tree. Um, I did originally clean these, but this is my third time shooting this one. So, bong got a little dirty again, sorry about that. But I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to show y'all how to fill up the bong perfectly. Try to angle that down. First comes first, we're going to start up here with the top perk. You got the down stem and you got a perk up here. It's eight arm tree perk. Got two slits of diffusion per arm. You see one set of diffusions right here. One set of diffusions right above it. And my water level, I'm going to want just a hair above that second slit. I'm going to take this cup here. Take a sip of it first. Good cup. Dump that in there. And then now as you all can see here. Get that a little closer. We are a little bit above that second slit of diffusion. So what I like to do, I just pull this down stem out a little bit. And I'll give it a slight puff air into the bong. And that's just going to push this water down these perks into the bottom chamber. I'm going to show you all kind of how that works. Kind of like a backward action in the bong. So next... We gotta fill up this bottom chamber, of course. Gotta have water in there, too. That's what we're working with. So, on the bottom one, I love water, guys. We're just gonna take this down stem out. We're gonna be trying to fill up all these slits of diffusion right there. And we're gonna go ahead, just get a little bit of water. I always just kind of guesstimate, eye it out on the first one. Down some is gross. I need a little more splash, so I'm just going to go one more splash in there. A little bit more. Now, let's see how she pulls. I need a full hit for this. We got perfect bubbling. Got plenty of room to milk it up still. And no splash. That is absolutely key to me. I do not want my bong splashing water up in my mouth. That is not tasty. Almost just knocked over another rig on that desk over there. Not paying attention. I got the eye dot drop down. Boom. Got another drop down. Uh oh. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to pack up a bowl. Smoking on some sherbet kush today. Mm, this stuff is awesomely tasty. I'm going to bust down a rip for y'all, and then I'm going to get a close-up of this big old nug I got. So about a 3.2 gram nug. It's pretty impressive. I'm going to get a big old rip packed up. Oh, yeah. Haven't been smoking for a couple hours, so I'm excited for this. But, I'm going to go ahead in. Got the mini Medicali set up. I just filled up that water. I'm going in on a perfect. I'll be bong rip. Cheers. Air conditioner's cranking. Y'all just saw all that smoke swirling around and shit. <coughs> Show y'all this nug. Oh, I actually forgot I broke the nug yesterday. So, <coughs> not quite as much. Not a 3.2 now. It's probably only a 2.5. But that's the Sherbert Kush. I know, I got a bad close-up. 
camera, I got an iPhone 4. Boom. <coughs> mm. That is relaxing though. The flavor on that, absolutely incredible. Not the most potent of the weeds, but taste wise, I'm gonna say if I wanna smoke something tasty, it's gonna be one of my favorite strands to smoke on. But y'all can already tell now. <coughs> We got Daddy Matt Cali. Adds on on about an extra six inches. Adds completely full thick tube here. And it's got an ice catcher. And a splash guard, actually. So, yeah, it's got a lot more better things to it. Make it a little bit of a better bong, a little more expensive. <coughs> but we're going to go with the same idea on this one. Get this also eight arm perk. Two slits of diffusion per arm filled up to the perfect amount of water right above it. We're going to do the same method. We're going to pull the down stem out, and that's really cool. I really like that trick. I remember when I learned it, I was ecstatic. <coughs> so pull this down. This little setup's really working out today. Probably because I've tried it so many times. But we're going to do the same thing on this too. We got a little, pull that down stem out. Fill it up with some water. Fill it up, fill it up, fill it up. Got a shorter down stem in this one. Boom, still needs a little more. Fill it up, fill it up. All right. Let's show y'all what we're working with. Boom, boom. Close up. Mmm, that is awesome. I can taste those dabs in that one. A few dabs I've dabbed off of it. But, up next, of course, we got the ice catcher up here. So normally I would have a spoon or something. But I'm going to be going straight on in. Pop in a few of these ice cubes. Really cool off that dab. Mmm. I like to, one of my tips also for using ice in a bong is that I never like to just uh, put a regular ice cube in here. I always fill up my cup of water first, turn that off a little bit, and then uh, use more a little bit melted ice cubes for filling that up. But I just do that because it actually you can compact more in here rather than just I would normally be able to fit three unmelted ice cubes. We got eight half ice cubes in here, just really cool it off. And throw this banger in here. We're gonna go in on dab. Dabbing on some of this OG shatter today. Only dab I got with me, I left my oil over at a buddy's house. But that's alright, even though I just picked it up. I picked it up and left it there all at the same time. But that's alright. I'm looking forward to this. I absolutely incredibly love this Medicali. Love dabbing out of it. Just delivers a huge hit. Gets it really deep into your lungs. Just really gets you stoned. Um don't even know if I can rip a combination hit off this just because of how long it takes to pull the smoke all the way through. But we're going to try, of course, to milk out the combo because it's down to 710. So I'm going to pack a little more in here. Heat up this now. See what we can do. But I hope, for those of y'all who don't know how to fill up a bong every day, like me, just got to hit this miss on that. But I hope this video helped you along, kind of educated you a little bit, get, you, get your bonds filled up right, and really just enjoy smoking. But if y'all enjoyed, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Go down in the comments, let me know what you're thinking. Um, also, don't forget to subscribe, share it with your friends. We broke 30 subscribers officially, so that is super cool. I appreciate that, guys. We're slowly making leeway. So this is just a little bit something different. I'm going to be throwing this one up in the glass specials playlist. Just because it's a little bit about glass. We've got some glass out here. Got the both drop down. So we're not going to be setting up. But. 
This one's just really a chill video, kind of. Chill, chill educational video. <sighs> Try to hit a combo. That was a big old hit, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Peace.